Hi friends, today let us go through some of the problems on plug flow reactor and mix flow reactor. Here the problem given is consider a gas phase reaction 2A gives rise to R plus 2S with unknown kinetics. If a space velocity of 1 per minute is needed for 90% conversion, space velocity is given and then the conversion is given but the kinetics is unknown of a plug flow reactor. Find the corresponding space time and mean residence time. We need to calculate space time and mean residence time of fluid in plug flow reactor. So the reactor is a plug flow reactor. An equation given 2A gives rise to R plus 2S with unknown kinetics. So tau is equal to as per the given data where tau is equal to 1 by S which is equal to 1 by 1 minute inverse and XA is equal to 0.9 as per the given date. So what is T bar for plug flow reactor? We already know from the performance equation where T bar is equal to CA0 into integral 0 to XA dXA divided by 1 minus RA into epsilon A XA and what is tau bar? Tau is equal to CA0 into integral 0 to XA dXA by minus RA. So the mean residence time T bar. So this tau doesn't allow us to find T bar unless minus RA is a function of concentration is known. So we have calculated space time tau is equal to 1 minute and then the mean residence time T bar. So with the unknown kinetics it doesn't allow us to find T bar. In an isothermal batch reactor 70% of a liquid reactant is converted in 13 minutes. What space time and space velocity are needed to effect this conversion in plug flow reactor and in a mixed flow reactor. See what is the space time and space velocity. As per the performance equation T is equal to CA0 into integral 0 to XA dXA divided by minus RA into 1 plus epsilon A XA T by T0. For plug flow reactor T is equal to CA0 into integral 0 to XA dXA by minus RA. And what is tau? Tau is equal to CA0 into integral 0 to XA dXA by minus RA. Tau is equal to T is equal to CA0 into integral 0 to XA dXA by minus RA. As per the given data, the time required a liquid reactant to convert is 13 minutes. This is 13 minutes. We know that S is equal to 1 by tau space velocity which is equal to 1 by 13 minute inverse. Space time is 13 minute and space velocity is equal to 1 by 13 minute inverse. A stream of aqueous monomer A enters a 2 liter mixed flow reactor is radiated therein and polymerizes as follows. This is the stoichiometric equation. If the exit stream CA is equal to 0.01 mole per liter and for a particular reaction product CW is equal to 0.002 mole per liter, find the rate of reaction of A and the rate of formation of W. CA0 is equal to 1 mole per liter V is equal to 2 liters, V0 is equal to 4 liter per minute, CA is equal to 0.01 mole per liter, CW is equal to 0.002 mole per liter. So first one let us calculate minus RA. Minus RA is equal to CA0 minus CAF divided by tau is equal to CA0 minus CAF divided by V by V0 is equal to 1 minus 0.01 divided by 2 by 4 is equal to 1.98 mole per liter minute. And second one RW rate of formation of W is equal to CWF minus CW0 divided by 
set tau is equal to if you substitute this values then you will get the rate of formation of w so we have calculated rate of formation of a and rate of formation of w from the given data we plan to replace our present mixed flow reactor with one having double the volume for the same aqueous feed and the same feed rate find the new conversion the reactant kinetics are represented by a gives rise to r and minus r a is equal to k into c a power 0.5 so this is the given data kinetics and rate equation and present conversion is 70 percent so the data given c a naught is equal to 10 mole per liter and the rate equation minus r a is equal to k into c a power 1.5 so here if you see so as per the given data we are present mixed flow reactor with one having double the volume so they are going to replace with the double the volume so initial conditions v naught and c a naught these are same and then we need to calculate the other conversion new conversion when the volume is changed so we can have here v by v naught is equal to c a naught into x a divided by minus r a so minus r a is equal to k into c a power 1.5 so what is c a c a is equal to c a naught into 1 minus x a power 1.5 so v by v naught is equal to c a naught x a by minus r a so minus r a is equal to k into c a c a is equal to c a naught into 1 minus x a so from here where we can get k v c a naught power 0.5 divided by v naught is equal to 4.26 let this value let us keep it aside and then what is the other condition so they have doubled the volume so 2v divided by v naught is equal to c a naught into the new conversion x a dash divided by k into c a naught power 1.5 into 1 minus x a dash power 1.5 so 2 into if we separate v k c a naught power 0.5 divided by v naught is equal to x a dash divided by 1 minus x a dash whole power 1.5 so we have this value 4.26 so you substitute the value 2 into 4.26 is equal to x a dash divided by 1 minus x a dash power 1.5 so if you solve this equation then we will be getting x a dash value so x a dash is equal to 0.794 so for the same feed rate the new conversion is 79.4 percent an aqueous feed of a and b is to be converted to products in a plug flow reactor the kinetics of the reaction is represented by minus r a is equal to k into c a c b find the volume of reactor needed for 99 percent 99.9 percent conversion of a to products a plus b gives rise to r and minus r a is equal to k into c a c b so let us write down the given data c a naught is equal to 100 millimole per liter c b naught is equal to 200 millimole per liter v is equal to 400 liter per minute we need to calculate the volume of a reactor where conversion x a is equal to 0.999 for a second order reaction k tau c a naught into m minus 1 is equal to ln of m minus x a by m into 1 minus x a where m is equal to c b naught divided by c a naught as per the given data 200 divided by 100 is equal to 2 let us substitute the data k is equal to 200 into tau into c a naught is equal to 0 0.1 into m minus 1 2 minus 1 which is equal to ln of 2 minus 0 0.999 divided by 2 into 1 minus 0 0.999 tau is equal to 
0.31 minute. So what we need to calculate? We need to calculate the volume of a plug flow reactor. So V is equal to tau into V naught. As per the given data, 0.31 into 400. V is equal to 124 liter. So this is the volume of reactor needed for 99.9% .9 conversion of A to products. A plug flow reactor 2 meter cube processes an aqueous feed containing reactant A. The reaction is reversible represented by A gives rise to R is a reversible reaction and minus RA is equal to K1 into CA minus K2 into CR. Find first the equilibrium conversion and then find the actual conversion of A in the reactor. So as per the given data, it's a PFR, A gives rise to R, it's a reversible reaction. So rate of reaction is given minus RA. So K is equal to K1 by K2 is equal to CRE divided by CAE is equal to XAE divided by 1 minus XAE equilibrium conversion. 0.04 divided by 0.01 is equal to 4. So from this we can calculate the equilibrium conversion XAE is equal to 0.8. So first part is finished. We have calculated the equilibrium conversion. And what is the other one? Find the actual conversion of A in the reactant. So to find out the actual conversion of A, for first order reversible reaction, kinetics are approximated by equilibrium conversion XAE K1 into tau by XAE is equal to minus ln 1 minus XA by XAE. So this equation 5.22 for a PFR. So let us substitute the values here. 0.04 into 2000 divided by 100 divided by XA is equal to 0.8 as we have already calculated. 1 minus XA divided by XA. So from here you can calculate XA. So what is uh, uh, XA here? XA is equal to 0.506. So this is the actual conversion of A in the reactor for a reversible reaction at a given rate equation at a particular conditions. The off gas from a boiling water nuclear power reactor contains a whole variety of radioactive trash. One of the most troublesome which being XC133. Half life time is given as 5.2 days. These off gas flows continuously through a large hold up tank in which it mean residence time is 30 days. And where we can assume that the contents are well mixed, find the fraction of activity removed in the tank. So we need to calculate XA. What is the fraction of activity? So T half is equal to 5.2. T bar is equal to 30 days. So we already know CA is equal to CA naught into exponential minus KT. So CA naught divided by 2 which is equal to CA naught into exponential of minus KT. So this is a 0.5. So CA naught CA naught which will be getting cancelled is equal to exponential of KT. So KT is equal to ln 2 k is equal to ln 2 divided by t so ln 2 divided by 5.2 as per the given data which is equal to 0.1333 day inverse we can assume that the contents are well mixed tau m is equal to ca naught into xa divided by minus RA which is equal to CA naught into XA divided by minus RA is equal to K into CA. CA is equal to CA naught into 1 minus XA. So CA naught CA naught which will be getting cancelled 
tau m is equal to xa divided by k into 1 minus xa. xa is equal to k tau m divided by k tau m plus 1. Let us substitute the given data. So, we already have k value and tau value. So, k value is equal to 0 0.1333 into tau m is equal to 30 divided by 0 0.1333 into 30 plus 1. xa is equal to 0.8. So, we have find out the fraction of activity removed in the tank. So, xa is equal to 80 percent. A mixed flow reactor process an aqueous feed containing reactant A. The reaction is reversible and represented by A gives rise to R. So, minus Ra is equal to K1 into Ca minus K2 into Cr. What is the equilibrium conversion and actual conversion in the reactor? So, what type of reactor? It is a mixed flow reactor. V is equal to 2 meter cube. Ca naught is equal to 100 millimole per liter. An equilibrium conversion which we need to calculate XAE and actual conversion XA. K is equal to K1 divided by K2 is equal to XAE divided by 1 minus XAE is equal to 0 0.04 divided by 0 0.01 is equal to 4. So, from this equation XA by 1 minus XA is equal to 4. XAE is equal to 0.8. So, we have calculated equilibrium conversion. And the other thing is we need to calculate the actual conversion in the reactor. So, minus RA is equal to K1 CA minus K2 CR minus RA is equal to K1. What is CA? CA is equal to CA naught into 1 minus XA minus K2 into CA naught into XA minus RA is equal to K1 CA naught into 1 minus XA minus K1 into 1 plus XAE divided by XAE into CA naught into XA where K1 by K2 is equal to XAE by 1 minus XAE. So, minus RA is equal to K1 CA naught 1 minus XA 1 plus 1 minus XAE divided by XAE. Where we have XAE value, XAE is equal to 0 0.8 and then we have tau m is equal to V by V naught is equal to 2000 divided by 100. So, where tau is equal to 20 and then this tau we can write it as CA naught into XA divided by minus RA. So, where we have CA naught into XA and minus RA, where we have written here minus RA. So, if you substitute this like tau is equal to, so we have substituted minus RA here and we already know the tau value is equal to 20 and just substitute the other values. Only the unknown value is XA. If we calculate XA from the above equation is equal to point. Four. So, we have calculated the actual conversion and then the equilibrium conversion for a reversible reactor with the given conditions like minus Ra is equal to K1 Ca minus K2 Cr. Everyone have to practice such type of problems so that it will be easier for you for gate examination.